Hey guys, it's Music by Lucas, and I want to start off this video by definitely congratulating our Song of the Week 65 winner, Size Matters, with their awesome remix of Ed Sheeran. You gotta check it out, I will leave the link below. Also, we got some awesome things coming this year, like a brand new version of TeamMBL.com, as well as the all new and first ever members only Patreon Lounge. I am super pumped about this video, and it is a long time coming. I know you guys have been asking for this, and I've been wanting to make it for you, so today, is gonna be about Alan Walker. Did you say Alan Walker? Alan Walker. All right guys, so we've gotten some amazing people to watch these videos, including last week's guy, Madison Mars. So let's see if we can get Alan Walker to watch his video today. I'm gonna leave his links right here so you know what to do, share, post, tweet, Instagram, anything you gotta do, and let's see if we can get Alan to watch. All right, so let's get started with three things that make Alan Walker so amazing. The first reason why Alan Walker is so amazing is because of his cinematic melodies. Alan Walker's music is not only addictive, it's the kind of music that can get you lost in your own imagination like you're in another world. The reason why this is so powerful is because it doesn't just make you want to jump at a festival, it invokes emotions that create memories and feelings that will last a lifetime. And this is probably one of the many reasons why his music has achieved such huge success. Most EDM producers are not going to say that they're inspired by cinematic music, but Alan says he was inspired by people such as Hans Zimmer. Now, if you don't know who Hans Zimmer is, is, I'll leave a link below because you got to check this guy out. He's uh, He wrote some music for some small movies, you know, like uh, The Dark Knight, Interstellar, Inception. So when you have some time, take a quick break from listening to Alan Walker and take a listen to some of the films that you like, listen to the scores and see if you are inspired too. When it comes to producing the music, Alan Walker says that some of his favorite plugins are Nexus 2, Silent, and Spire. Another interesting thing about Alan is that he didn't come from a musical background proving that you don't have to start playing piano at age five to be a musical success. In fact, he actually learned how to produce music by watching videos here on YouTube. Good choice, Alan. The second reason why Alan Walker is so amazing is because of the incredible vocals on his tracks. If people thought Alan Walker's tracks were hits before they had vocals, they became mega hits after the vocals were added. Having a good vocal on your track can not only make it get stuck in people's heads more, but it can also give your track incredible remixing potential. This is part of the reason why his tracks have been remixed by some incredible producers such as Tiesto, Marshmallow, Slushy, just to name a few. As an aspiring producer though, it can be really hard to find good vocals because you may not have the contacts or the professional studio to record them in. And this is partly why remixes are so popular because the vocals are already there. But next time when you're finished with a track or if one of your tracks has already done really well and you're wondering if you can make it do even better, consider collabing with a vocalist on your next track. You can find many vocalists online, including on SoundCloud, and it never hurts to ask them if they're interested. Because if the vocals are done right, you can really take your track to the next level. The third reason why Alan Walker is so amazing is because of his branding and the mask. Alan Walker's logo and his mask are not only badass, but they're also incredible branding symbols. Alan Walker says in interviews that he got the idea from his mask from the outfits of online hacking groups. Interesting. Alan says you can put on a hoodie and a mask and you can immediately become a walker. And it's also a sign that no matter who you are, you can become a walker because we're all equal. Now, I don't know about you, but after reading that, I think I might have to get one of those hoodies. What do you guys think? I think it's missing. There's something missing. I think I'll call this look the half walker. I know that subjects like branding can get really frustrating and at the end of the day, all you wanna do is just get back to the music, as you should. But the reason I'm here and the reason why I make these videos is to help you look at the bigger picture and to understand both the business and the musical side of things. But these topics are the topics that are not usually covered on YouTube. Because you can find EDM tutorials on YouTube everywhere, but what I'm here for is to help you try to uncover the big picture. There are artists that get lucky with a track or get signed because of their connections or hack the internet to get their track a million plays. But you see, these careers, they're gonna fade as fast as they were made. What these videos are about are about teaching you to be smarter. Of course, to inspire you to do what you love and to have fun. Like Alan Walker says, don't be so hard on yourself and don't think of music as a full-time job. Think of it more as a hobby. Alan Walker thinks of music as a hobby because it takes the pressure off and it reminds him that it's supposed to be fun. It's not supposed to be something that he stresses out over or that drives him crazy. He's supposed to be able to just get in the studio and do what he loves. This is the best hobby in the world. All right guys, that's it for Alan Walker. And remember, there's gonna be a brand new feedback video coming tomorrow, we're doing them every week. And I wanna give a big shout out to my new awesome Patreon supporter, Malcolm Urban. You rock, man, we're gonna be working together a lot. I'm Music by Lucas and I'll see you later.